Timothy Olson appearing in court for the first time in person this year. Now, he did not have an attorney seated next to him, but he did have a surprising request for the judge. We're advised by the public defender's office that at this point, Mr. Olson has refused to have an attorney appointed to represent him. Mr. Olson had also filed a letter requesting that he proceed pro se. So is that your request at this time, Mr. Olson? Yeah, I was requesting if, if you could uh, appoint an attorney to as like co-counsel to help me. Olson is accused of multiple crimes against women, including the abduction of a 79-year-old woman at gunpoint in Franklin. In two separate hearings, Timothy Olson asked the judge to remove his court-appointed public defender. Olson told Judge Childs he feels he's left with no other option than to represent himself, as he feels the attorneys appointed to his case would not represent him justly. I really want to give you a chance to, to think about it, because I know it's a major decision in regards to this. Uh, I'm willing to appoint an attorney. If I appoint an attorney, the goal, the goal ultimately is that we're just not going to continue to fire and remove. Judge Childs has scheduled a status of counsel hearing for Monday morning. At that time, Olson will have to decide if he will move forward with his court appointed attorney or if he will decide to represent himself. In Milwaukee, Gabriela Garza, WISN 12 News.